What's up, guys? So quick chat because this is an important topic, especially when you're in the flow and you're trying to manifest and create and you're up leveling yourself and you're reaching higher vibrations. You have to be aware of those that are in your environment that aren't in control of their vessels and have the potential to be used by the enemy, the opposition to disrupt your energy, to disrupt, disrupt you, creating, disrupt you, disrupt you up leveling your life. They don't have to be bad people. They don't. Ha they can be family. They can be friends. They can be co-workers. But you have to be aware of these people that don't have control of their vessels. For example, you can be in the flow of creating or doing something amazing, manifesting something that requires you to have intense focus in your mind, positive energy, and positive vibes. And the way the enemy disrupts that is by entering, putting, planting seeds of destruction in your mind. And if the enemy cannot get to your mind, the enemy will use your friends, your coworkers, whoever is closest to you who have access to you or access to your mind and your energy. And they'll send them your way in an attempt to disrupt that flow. It could be a friend. They don't have to be a bad person. Again, it's just they aren't spiritually mature. They aren't mentally mature or emotionally mature or something, some sort of thing like that. And they'll plant a seed of destruction in their mind. You don't even have to do anything to them. But they'll plant it in their mind, something negative about you. And then that person will come your way while you're creating or while you're in the flow or while you're doing something amazing, while you're manifesting to, to disrupt it. One, that's why it's important to understand who you have around in your environment, who can be used. That way you can limit your time with these people or you might even have to block them for a while while you're creating or just say, hey, I'm busy for this time period. I won't be able to talk to you for this time period. Whatever it is that you have to do, but you have to, you, you must be aware of those people. It's the art of war. It's the art of spiritual war. It's the art of creation. It is a part of it. It just is. And you also have to have your foundation on the rock so that you can't be moved or you won't be moved by the actions of others. And you can understand, oh, that's a trick of the enemy. I'm not going to let the enemy get in the flow. It's very, it's, it's definitely a challenge to do, but you just have to be aware of these people or you have to be aware of the tricks of the enemy that will that's attempting to get you out of the flow of manifestation, out of the flow of living in a higher vibration of creating, of financial abundance, whatever it is that you're doing, you have to be aware that, yes, the enemy will use other people, places, or things, or thoughts, or whatever it is to get me out of my vibration, but I'm not going to let it happen. But also, the people that can be used to, that are, that have access to you. You have kids who have access to you. You have parents who have access to you. You have friends who have access to you. But you have to know which one of these people, because everybody ain't on your vibration. And that's just life. Everybody in your life won't be on your vibration. But you have to be like, okay, this person is emotionally unstable and they have the, you know, the enemy can use them and try to disrupt me by planting seeds of destruction. The enemy will tell them that you said something a year ago and then they'll come and, oh, did you do this? Or the enemy will tell them that they're entitled to your time or entitled to your energy or entitled to your money or something. And they'll come and attack you for no reason because they aren't in control of their own emotions. So anyway... Just be aware of that. Know that it's a trick of the enemy. Stay in the flow of energy around you so that you can manifest and, and create whatever it is that you're doing. I just wanted to quickly get that out because the enemy has tried to trick, you know, I know the tricks of the enemy, so I'm not going to let it get to me. But it's, it's, you know, it's energy, nevertheless. So if these people have access to you and you have energy, positive energy, and this negative energy is trying to enter you, it's still a fight. And fighting that negative energy takes energy. And you want to use all your energy to create. I want to use all of my energy to create. I don't want to have to take time, mental, spiritual energy to fight off negative thoughts and feelings or emotions or someone who's trying to disrupt me. So now it's like, okay, maybe these people don't need to be in your life at all. But if they have to be in your life, limit your time with them, especially when you're manifesting. Okay, God. All right, thanks. <laughs> Before I go, know that the enemy comes to steal, kill, and destroy. So you can let the enemy know you cannot steal, kill, or destroy the energy around me. I am in the positive flow of the currencies around me. I am in the positive flow of the energy around me in abundance, increase and overflow in my life. I am vibrating higher spiritually, vibrating higher mentally, vibrating, vibrating higher in life and love and happiness and joy. I am in the positive flow of the energy around me. I can create. I have the ability to create. I am creating. I'm manifesting increase in my life right at this moment, right now. Enemy, you cannot steal, kill, or destroy my energy. You cannot take my energy you cannot transfer my energy in a negative form 
I will remain in the positive flow of the energies around me, increase and overflow in my life, and there's nothing you can do about it, period. <laughs> Just have to let the enemy know because when people come to steal, kill, and destroy your energy, you got to rebuke that, stop that, and use the power of God inside of you. I'm God. You can't steal God's energy because I'm God, period. You got to let them know. All right, bye.